Howdy, welcome to another Kicks Locale press conference for Event 41. And we got the much highly anticipated title fight between Optimal and Babtunji. And the fact that this has been hyped up for like over, not over, but almost a year. And both guys have come up and grown so much. Both are a, a respective champ in, in both in each league that they're in. And currently, and we about to actually settle something really fucking amazing right now. So let's get this shit started. Same formulas I had the last three press conferences. Um, I chose not to really have an audience or tell anybody about we when we were doing this live because just, I don't know. It's just a different vibe for me. But, um, yeah, so let's get this started. So first one, it's not really a question. It's from Jay Bands. It's just a good luck to both of y'all in the championship. All right, so first question from Ash Uh I guess we can start with the champ first, though. It says, uh, shit, both champs, but the kicks champ first. Um, from Ash win or lose, <laughs> will you both still hate each other? We can start with Optimal. I don't hate the guy, you know what I'm saying? Like he he won one against me and you know, he I guess that field him to talk shit or whatever, so he still he gotta fight me. But after that we can be cool, we can spar or whatever. And for Bab, same question. Depends if I win. If I lose then Nothing else. You got nothing else to say about it, man. Just if you if you lose, that's it's gonna be beat. No, I'm petty, bro. I'm petty, bro. <laughs> if I lose, I ain't gonna be cool. <laughs> well, you look like we ain't gonna be cool then, cause you getting three zero. Hey, excuse me. Who who's the one who lost to CJ? Is is that me or you? We both lost to CJ, right? Yeah, but only one of us beat CJ. I mean, you had two cracks in it, though. I ain't, I only fought him once. So, I mean. Yeah, I used to go on the squirrel. Yeah, you also had a squirrel in the TV, too. The fuck? Okay. Next question from Prodigy. This is for Optimal. What loss was the one that woke you up and made you enter what is now deemed as your prime? My losses in sparring. Because, I mean, a lot of these guys beat me when I wasn't motivated. Like, a couple of losses I had. I wasn't really motivated to even win. I had, like, kind of like league fatigue and shit. So, really just me in sparring. I'm learning from losses in sparring and shit, basically. Capri, next question. Yeah, yeah, from Capri. This is for Bab. Um, what do you think that you can do better than Optimal? Um, his defense is like really basic. He like if you mix up shots, he doesn't block any of it. So I'm just gonna box that motherfucker up, and then yeah, it's over. Three zero, easy. Nice answer, nice answer, and then, all right. Yeah, that sound. Say again, Optimal? No, nah, I just said it sound good. You're going you gonna to box me up, huh? Okay. We'll see. All right. I hope you, I hope you make the most of all this time you need before we fight. Oh no, heavens forbid I'm busy during the week. Bro, shut up. You shut up, dipshit. <laughs> All right, no. Fucking idiot. Want a, want a title shot, but want to wait a whole fucking week before the fight. But you, you jump in to do the press conference because you just want to talk shit. Pussy.
My guy, I'm busy during the week. The fuck do you want me to do? Cancel plans? Nah, man. I'm free right now to do the press conference. After this shit, I'm going to bed, so... Lord forbid I fucking interrupt tea time. The fuck does that even mean? Next few questions I ask you for me. We don't got too much questions as far as like this press conference, but you know, I definitely got some interesting questions myself. Um, all right, so this one's from me from uh, to both of you guys. Uh, we're going the same order again, Kicks Champion. Um, from when and where did this whole little feud initially start? You can go with Optimal first. I honestly do do not know, bro. But I mean, every time somebody get a win on me or something, they always popping shit or saying something out the way, you know. Because I, I guess I'm just that worthy of an opponent. So I don't know. Maybe maybe when he won in an exhibition that I was, you know, coming off of a layoff to fight, maybe in that he felt the need to like pop his shit or whatever. But I mean, these are different times. So. Oh, I did not just win. You did absolutely nothing. You were fucking useless. Okay. No, no response. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, just, just okay. You're so good at talking shit, bro. Really yeah, entertaining. I mean, I'm. I'm really. I didn't come here to really talk shit, bro. I didn't really even. Bro want to threatened to. to bro threatened to interrupt my tea time. What the fuck? <laughs> Uh, All right, Bab, same question for you. When, where do you think, when and where did you think this feud initially start? Well, I vacated the belt because I was whooping everyone's ass. And then this guy, Optimal, comes in. Um, obviously, Rick beat Nonprofit. I was like, okay. Then I was, I was back in Rick to beat Optimal. Then... Before that, I said I said Optimal was was the number two in the league. I said I was number one, and he took major offense to that for some reason, and then started beating decent opponents. I guess I don't know. Now he thinks he's a shit. I mean, who has he beat really? Well, I beat Rick twice. He lost to CJ. He beat Kipri, who's not really beat anyone. Who else? Gotham. He beat Gotham when he was playing like shit. Bro, this guy ain't it, man. Bruh, you just fought Prodigy twice. And Prodigy fucking washed. And you barely beat him. Yeah, I sent you a picture that I was playing on, bro. What was... The fuck you expect me to do? Guy. I always excuse me from this guy. Bro, an, ex a an excuse implies I'm making shit up. I sent the pictures, bro. There's receipts. <laughs> Fuck. It happened. And then the second time, I whooped his ass, and you yourself said it was a good performance, so... Alright. Next question. For me as well. This one's for Optimal. Um... What do you think you have over Bab Toonsie that he doesn't skill wise and accolades wise? This is for Optimal. Oh, uh, what's that, bro? Yeah, yeah, I'm muting because he because he ain't got nothing. Uh, the question was, what do you what do you think you have over Bab Toonsie that he doesn't have skill wise and accolades wise? I got the better IQ. Uh, he not really a smart fighter. He don't react well to pressure. And even even though I'm telling him all this now, like he this stuff that he need to work on before he fight me, it won't make a difference. And as far as accolades go, I got the most defenses. I've been involved in the most title fights. I've been in ten, and of ten of those, I won seven. So I'm just better. Seven. 
Motherfucker, I'm undefeated in title fights. And I had the most dominant reign. And no one beat me. I never lost the belt. You have lost the belt, my guy. You you fall in a tournament of champions. I wouldn't even fucking eat. I didn't force you to not participate, my guy. You chose. Ain't my fault. All right, next question. Um, this one's for Bab. Uh. What would having the MFL SMB belt and the Kicks Locale belt simultaneously mean to you? It'll mean I am the fucking GOAT, bro. Like, real shit. What, what, what was Optimal done outside of Kicks? Nothing. <laughs> Literally nothing. You know? Like he hasn't proved himself I mean, in my, else. In my opinion, kicks is the best league it is. So I mean, I don't really have to do much outside of kicks. You know what bro, I'm saying? But I mean, but but since you since you since you want to talk, bro, I'll be making my MFL debut pretty soon, and I'm coming for that belt. So just be ready for that, and don't fucking retire you. Cause I heard you was talking about retiring. Don't fucking yeah. retire. Why not? The fuck. I'm already fighting you here. I don't need to fight you twice. I don't want to humiliate you that yeah, bad, bro. Yeah, duck me. Like you've been, like you trying How to do that now. I'm fighting yeah. you this week. If it look like a duck and it sound like a duck, it's a fucking duck. Oh, let me get it. I'm fighting you, but I'm ducking you. Okay, bro. You ain't yeah. fighting me until you fought me, bro. So fight me, and then, then I'll say you didn't duck me. But you got to fight me first. Make it to the fight. We are scheduled to fight. I've agreed to fight. How is that ducking in any way? Please tell me. Have we fought? How is that ducking, though? I can say no, you're ducking have... me. No, I won't believe it until I see you on the screen. Nah, except my... Optimal's ducking me. We I haven't have fought yet, man. No, ducking me. In the Stop ducking, bro. So this one's back to optimal. Um, what would a win over the current MFL SMB champ mean to you, as far as also being a Kicks Locale champion currently? That'll make me the uncrowned king of MFL, and that motherfucker will be a fraud over there. That's what that'll mean. When, and when he go to defend that belt, he ain't gonna feel like a real champion after he lose to me. All right. And back to Bab. So uh, this might actually be the last, one of the last few questions. This is for Bab. How long do you plan on defending the MFL Stand and Bang belt? And if you win the Kicks belt back, how long would you plan plan on defending that? I already, I already said after my um my title fight was shown, my next fight is my last one on UFC four. This was this was said before, and did this little bitch piped up about it. Hey, Bab, let's make a deal. Let's make a deal, Bab. This one time, you, I'm gonna you, do you it. There, you there, buddy? Huh? You there? Let's make a let's like let's make a deal, Bab. No, <laughs> fuck let's off. Make, let's let's make a deal. Get at, least, nuts, at least, at least, at least, hear me. At least hear me. Okay. So if I, if I, if I beat you, yeah, give me a, give me a title shot on MFL. I'm not a fucking matchmaker, bro. Oh, okay. I don't go give out title shots. I get who I get. You have to win there first, which will be a, yeah, not looking likely. Congrats on your win too against Gotham, bro. What? That, was, that was a that was a good win. I know, bro. <laughs> okay, thanks. Right. And so what do you guys think between uh what do you what do you guys think 
three zero. Who? What? What was the results gonna be between you guys? Easy three zero, hard three two, little bit of a three one. What you guys thinking? I know he's gonna go three zero. No, it's not gonna be that. Maybe three one. Me. You know, I'll I'll win one. Maybe lose the next if I get too cocky, start taunting him and shit, and win the next two, something like that. I'm not gonna sweep him. He's he's good. But I'm gonna win regardless. I mean, you know, it, it it won't take me more than one fight to get him figured out. He's easy. And for Optimus, what do you, what do you think? What's the result? Three zero, three one, three two. Yeah, three oh. Bab told you you're a good fighter, but it's just it's level city shit and he gonna find out. He he definitely gets three O's and none of the fights are gonna be close or competitive. Did I literally just said you'd say that. Fuck. I mean, well, it's the fucking truth. <laughs> like every time I said it happened, every, ask God, ask your boy. And how how is he doing? Is he is he okay? Cause I hadn't I hadn't really heard from him since our fight. I've heard from me, he's fine, he don't give a fuck, bro. That was not the best Gotham. You beat a, um... Excuses! Well, it wasn't, the fuck? You saw him, he played better against me than he played against you. He's not a welterweight guy anyway, I am. There's levels to this shit, bro. Who else have you beat? You beat a calf player. Kepri. He's, he's alright. Who have you beat? Bro, you can't, you can't beat Rick or Capri. I have beat Rick. I knocked Rick out with Nate Diaz. <laughs> so don't don't tell me I can't beat him, bro. I did. And what? I can't beat Capri? Why not? What What does Capri do that I can't? Come on. Yeah, stay mute. We'll, we'll see. After I beat you, then you can fight Capri. There, there we go. Problem solved. No, no, no. You said I can't beat him. So tell me why. I'm not gonna give away the game plan. Game plan, yeah, but just know, bro. just know that Capri, Capri got, got the tools to beat you, bro. Capri I'm not gonna give away the game plan. One thing, plan, one thing he has, one thing he has over me. Come on. Well, he got, he got a good, he got better footwork than you, I would say. But that's that's not really saying <laughs> much because <laughs> everybody got better footwork. footwork. Everybody got better footwork than you. So Why do I need to show footwork first of all? Because I just mow people down. Mow me down, bro. You don't, you don't know what I can do, man. You ain't seen shit. You see me beat up bums. I, I won't, I won't get a chance to see it in our fight either, because you won't, you gonna be too busy trying to survive. Oh no, big scary champions threatening me, Jesus. Oh, Fucking yeah. right. Fucking right. You and I'll so be champ. I'll be, custom. I'll be the champ of MFL too. No chance. You you are not that good, bro. <laughs> Chill. I'll come over there and take your shit. You do realize you, you've got to beat people first, right? You don't just get an immediate title shot because, because you have the kicks belt. <laughs> Ain't how it works, man. Who the fuck you think you're going to beat? Well, you're going to get booked against James or some shit and get smoked. That's just that. Simple. If you guys had a chance to say something really uniquely nice about each other, just one thing and not no basic shit like, oh, he's a good player, he's an alright player, he got good, he got good IQ or whatever. If you guys had something uniquely nice and positively complimentary to say about each other, what would one... Just one thing. What would it be? Let, let's start with let's start with optimal. You know, uh, he he was a champion in kicks before. Right, and then bad. He tried his best against CJ. question for me you know i always laid off like this at the end of every press conference if you guys had anything else to say about each other 
or to each other, you guys may mute and shit and just go ahead. Yeah. I've said pretty much everything I had to say to him. I'm ready to fight. You got, you I, I was ready to because you're a boring motherfucker. I was, I was ready to fight him today, but I mean, he had something to do, I guess. A chimney to sweep or maybe some milk to deliver. I don't know. But uh, I'm just ready to fight. And um, I hope he show up to the fucking fight ready with no excuses because, I, I mean, whatever, I don't care what the fuck going on. During our fight, I don't want to hear no excuses, bro. Especially for for somebody who called himself a champion. So that's it. Okay, bro, you are the most basic motherfucker, Jesus. Um, well, what, what can I say about Mister Optimal? Um, he he better better come with a better game plan than walking backwards and throwing jabs. That that'd be a good a good starting point. Um, yeah, start it real. I mean, you walk forward and throw jabs. So what's the difference? Like really, you just walk forward and throw jabs all day. So I hope you're not doing. So again, optimal kind of cut off. I just hope he don't walk forward and throw jabs. So he, since you want to talk about jabs so much, this motherfucker throw a hundred jabs around. So let's not talk about jabs. All right, then. This is uh, no, nothing else to say. Going once, going twice. Jab tunes. Leave your ass frozen like Elsa. Not this shit again, bro. He gonna leave me frozen like Elsa. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna leave you tangled like Rapunzel, bro. You're gonna get wrecked like Ralph. <laughs> Alright, this is awesome, man. We got the current Kicks Locale champion facing off against the current a newly crowned MFL SMB champ, also a former Kicks Locale champ. I don't know what matchup can get any more bigger than this. Um, I'm excited. I'm personally excited. I don't know what's gonna happen, who's gonna win, but this is gonna be. I'm sure this is gonna be fireworks and potential for Hall of Fame fighting kicks. So, I just want to thank you both for doing what you guys doing, participating, and let's let's get this shit popping on. On Thursday, right? You guys, you guys want to fight on Thursday? Yeah, Thursday, and if not right. Thursday, Friday. I have Either to. I time. have. I guess I have to be into the will of the. Well, you have ready. to make some compromise, bro, because I can't do it before Thursday. <laughs> Simple. Well, we we can compromise, bro. Like so, so Thursday it is. Thursday or Friday. Thursday or th which one? I don't mind. Either's fine. What well, Thursday? Okay. Deal? Thursday we, we, we fighting Thursday? I've just said three times, bro. I don't know. I just have to I got to lock you into a commitment, bro, because you just you be ducking and backtracking and all kind of weird yeah. shit be going on with Why you. Why if I talk to all backtracked? You just making shit. Bro, up you, this point. you literally you literally tried to duck. Prodigy and y'all first fight in the middle of the fucking fight, bro. Y'all was one and one. You talking about you want to run this, finish the set another day. Who does because, that? Because I was at a fucking disadvantage on a shitty TV. Why even take the fight? And I still you know won. That you, if you know that you wasn't ready to fight, why take the fight? And why yeah, you so I mean, comfortable making excuses all the time? Done, what? Because it's true? The fuck? I'm not making shit up. It literally happened. And I still won. And then I beat him again, convincingly. Easy. You've seen the levels. So when have I backtrack or ducked? Tell me. Who have I ducked? Your fight style is shite. That's not what I asked. <laughs> um, I, I just, duck? Want, to, I just want to make sure I said that before the press conference. So. Yeah, keep walking backwards, bro. You're a shite fighter. 
Why are you all of a sudden saying shite? The <laughs> fuck? Oh, no answer. Okay. Cool beans, bro. Alright, guys. Event 41 press conference. Thank you both yet again. This was pretty entertaining. I had a whole back laughter, so thank you guys. Uh, yeah, that's it. You guys, you guys can go. That's pretty much it. Thank <laughs> you.